is a very good question. As a question on functions, we told the function from A to B is 1 to 1, but not on to. From B to C, on to, but not 1 to 1. C back to A is injective, but not surjective. Right? Obviously, there is some terminology here as well. And we need to know the definitions of 1, 1, on to, all of that. I right? want to start with A to B. This is 1 to 1, but not on to. That means, to start with, this is a function. So, every element here is mapped to something here. And this is 1 to 1 as opposed to many to 1, which means every element here that has been mapped on from something here is mapped on from only one element here. So, if I have something here, this is pointing to this, then nothing else can point to the same element. You have something here, this is pointing to this, nothing else can point to the same element. However, we are told this is not on to. That means not every element in this set has been mapped on from something here. So, there is some element here which is not mapped on from anything. That means every element here has to have a map, has to have an image. Every element has to have only one image. If there are A elements here, then there are A different images here because this is one to one. Apart from that, there are some elements here which are not mapped. The clearest takeaway from here, the number of elements in this set is less than number of elements here. In the number of elements here, that many images will be there because each element is pointing to a distinct image here. And then there are some left or the takeaway here is A is less than B. Now, in this case, this is on to but not one to one. It is on to. What does that mean? Every element here has been mapped on from at least one element here. There is no element in C, in set C, that is not an image of something here. Whatever we call as the range, that is same as the codomain. There is nothing in C that has not been mapped down from something here. However, this is not one to one. So that means there is at least one element here that is mapped from more than one element here. At least one element which is mapped from more than one element here. If you take one element as mapped on from more than one element, that means this will have to have fewer elements than this straight away. It's a very important takeaway, very interesting takeaway. If I have six elements here, that means in ideal case, I could have six different images. What, what I mean by ideal case is, I have to have maximum number of elements here, given that the function is on to, I'll have to have six. However, it is not one to one. So, I can have six elements pointing to only five, only four, or all pointing to only one element. If it is not one to one, the elements here have to be fewer than the elements here, or we know straight away from here that B is greater than C. We know A is less than B, B is greater than C, or B is greater than A and C. That much we know. Now, let us come to the third one, but we still do not know whether A is greater or C is greater. So let us come to this. This is the function that is injective, but not surjective. It is not surjective or it is not on to. It is injective or it is one to one. And so, from C to A, the function is one to one not on to. It is very similar to from A to B. A to B it is 1 to 1 not on to. C to A 1 to 1 but not on to. Just going over it again, every element here has to have an image. Every element has a different image because each element here that is part of the range is pointed at from a distinct element or the number of elements here should be more than the number of elements here because this is not on to. There are some elements here that are not mapped on from anything from here. When there are some elements in A that are not mapped on from anything from C, and every element in A that is mapped on from something in C is mapped on from only one element in C. So the takeaway here is C is less than A. Now I'm just going to put the three things together. We know B is the largest. B is greater than C and B is greater than A. So B is the largest. C is less than A. So we have C less than A less than B. Very interesting question, mainly because it helps us focus on two things, definition of 1 to 1, on to, or the opposites also, many to 1, into. So, we know what these terms mean. The second thing, terminology, injective and surjective. Surjective means on to, injective means 1 to 1. We know the definitions of 1 to 1 and on to, and we go through this terminology as well. Wonderful question on top.